My name's James Thompson, I'm the project manager here at Macquarie Towers. Uh, behind me here we've got our uh, concrete pump and our adges here to finish off our capping beam pour. So what the capping beam does is it, is it ties together the uh, CFA piles we've already put in. So they provide essentially a locking mechanism for the piles once we start our, our bulk excavation. The, the capping beam and the piles are part of um, the retention wall system that, we, that we're using for our basement. So once the capping beam's done, that'll allow us to come back and strip the formwork off the reinforced concrete capping beam. From there we can start excavating down and we'll be going down three storeys in our, in our basement. Expected duration of that is, is within sort of two to three months from when we start stripping the capping beam. And from there our basement walls are done and we can start going back up again. Hi everyone, Peter here from GWH Real Estate. Just giving everyone a construction update on Macquarie Tower. Despite the interest rate rises over the last few months, the confidence in our inquiry has been quite strong in the last three to four weeks in particular, with numbers of appointments in our display suite increasing every single week. Our team at GWH Real Estate are really excited about the feedback we're getting from our buyers that have purchased so far Macquarie Tower. Uh, the exciting thing for these purchases is that they really can't wait to get on levels 13, 14 and 15 and seeing those views from Stockton through to Dully, through to Redhead and all the way to Caves Beach. Uh, it's really incredible to see ocean views from Lake Macquarie and Charlestown. Uh, we can't wait. Bring them up.